Loki Sondergren across right side. Frey ahead, back by Jack Silich inside of his own zone. Sondergren a lead feed for Silich once more. Gets across the blue line. Right circle, shot stop. De La Russa, rebound, scores. And the Bucs open the scoring in game six as it's a shot off the right pad from Jack Silich. And right on the doorstep is Noah Ernest for goals in back-to-back games. And Cranbrook takes a 1-0 lead. Landon Hilditch stepped up the blue line and tried to make a check to go back and watch that and rule that there was goalie interference on the play that did not allow De La Russo or knock De La Russo down entirely. So 10.05 to go first period. 1-0 remains the score. The Warriors win the draw. We'll see if that can give them a boost. Off the end board scores. Sean Cohane worked it off a stanchion to the back of the net. And the Warriors tie the game. And in the span of five seconds, Cranbrook's gone from a two-goal lead to a tie game. Sean Cohane worked it off of a stanchion at the penalty box. Captain was going to play the puck to his glove side and it went into the back of the net. Dylan Brooks onto it here for the Warriors. Right wing now for Kier Costas. Back around to the left side here. Sent ahead by Crayer. Out at center. It's a breakaway for Trent Wilson. In alone, he scores! Wilson in alone from the blue line on a feed from Dylan Crayer and beats Captain on the blocker side. And the Warriors have their first lead of game number six and take a 2-1 advantage. Boy, Wilson was all alone in the neutral zone, and Dylan Crayer spotted him from inside of his own end, and Wilson able to bury it past the blocker side of Carter Captain. Capasso at center, forcing that back in as Cranbrook will get the change that they desire. Hildich up the boards left side. Farrell poked it ahead now for Lockberg in across the blue line to the high slot to the right circle. Lockberg just lost the handle on that. Banked off the boards and out at center. Here comes Julian Frias down the left wing. Lost the handle on it but dropped it off. Donovan Frias to the net is safe. Rebound scores! It's Samuel Line who picks up his first BC Hockey League goal, batting that puck in out of midair on the shot from Donovan Frias from the left circle and the rebound off the left pad of De La Russo. And Cranbrook's tied this game, it's two to two. Twisting and turning away from a check of Sodergren. Still loose there as Kirkostas comes up with the puck. Back behind the net, forced it around left side. Crayer up top, Cohane. Left point to the net, screamed it wide. Comes back around to the right side. Wilson tried to send it back to the blue line. It's intercepted and started the other way. Dylan or Donovan Frias, left wing side. Samuel Line, a shot stop. Rebound scores. Julian Frias on a rebound from the right circle. Goes up and over the glove side of Matthew Tellerusso. And Cranbrook's taking the lead for the second time in game number six. It's 3-2 bucks. Number five on Friday. The power play has been a big lifeline for the Warriors. We'll see if it is here. Karan left point. Right side Nordstrom. Holding in the right circle, down low, quick pass in front, left side, Karan scores! Quick movement on the power play, and Felix Karan has his fourth of the series. This game's tied, it's 3-3. Just 12 seconds into the power play, a great feed in front, and it's Jackson Kierkostas on the feed from Trent Wilson, who spots Karan in the left circle, and his quick shot beats Captain on the blocker side. Seven and a half minutes gone here in the third period. Felix Caron, his fourth goal of the series. Caron to the middle. Here's Nordstrom with it now. Power play's come to an end. Wilson to the net, and he fired it just wide. Comes back along the boards to the right side. Raced out the center. Jaden Fotchuk out of the box. Cuts to the net. He scores!
And this series will go to seven games. Jaden Fodchuk out of the penalty box with speed past the 